That's right. Hey, what's up, guys, and welcome to News Ish. It's yours truly, Sam Walsh, bringing you all the scoop from here in Lagos State, Nigeria. Now, first off on our stories today, Zayn Malik is yet to release his, or rather is set to release his autobiography at the age of 23. Now, who does this? What have you got to say at the age of 23? However, he has said that his autobiography is not going to be the regular stories about his life and what he's been through. It's going to be just his personal pictures, his thoughts, and a few drawings. Really very personal, really a way to let people see into his life the way he hasn't let anybody else. All right, now moving on, Jude Okoye, the square brother. Anybody knows him? Come on now, you guys already know. Judo Koye has been the manager to the P-Square Boys. Now, he went to Instagram the other day and took to celebrate his lovely daughter on her first day of school. Now, Emma is the daughter's name. He shares his daughter with ex-beauty queen Ify, and she's absolutely adorable. He put up the caption saying, such a proud moment for daddy. Um, it's the first day of school. Basically, he's just being a proud dad. So yeah. All right, now, just three months ago, Scales was in a relationship with a girl called Sese. I hope I said that right. But he's moving on very fast as he has come to Instagram again to announce that he has found himself yet another lovely lady. Now, what we have, sources tell us that he met his girlfriend, a new girlfriend, in Texas because she manages a club there. Um, I don't know how I feel about the whole public thing and putting your relationships out there, but Scales has come out to show that he does not care what anybody thinks. He's going to flaunt his girlfriend and his relationship as he likes. All right, now during an interview last year, Basket Mouth had said that he and Sean Tizzle were not on good terms. Now, one year later, September 14th, it was Basket Mouth's birthday. Right, so gotcha, everybody knows him, Nigerian comedian. And Sean Tizzle took to Instagram and Twitter to officially wish the comedian a happy birthday. So basically squashing the beef. All right, now apparently we hear also that they're going to be going on tour. All right, now finally comedian Kofi has done an open letter and put it on Instagram saying, aside many other things, that Kiss Daniel's career is short-lived, or rather maybe short-lived, if he does keep up with his Two-Face act. Now, this is a deep sentence to make if you ask me, but I'm gonna let the judges judge, which is you guys. I don't know what comedian Kofi is talking about, but he must know something that we don't. However, I'll be back with more interesting news right here on News Ish. Keep it locked. That's right.